I think we're officially nesting over here. Let me show you what's currently happening in my bathroom. <laughs> I'll insert some clips from last night when we first started so you can get a for sure before shot. We have officially started this bathroom remodel. Baby boy will be here before we know it and we're ready to get this looking a lot better. So this is the before, but this isn't even like really a good before shot. I'll have to insert a photo of like the house listing when we first bought this house because <clears throat> I painted this tile at one point because it was this like ugly beige color. But yeah, I'll have to show you how bad it really was. Oh, it was this. Okay, we got the new bathtub going in tonight and I am making dinner. I am currently browning up some ground beef. We're gonna have tacos tonight and then I'm gonna save half of it to make some beef enchiladas later in the week. So I just got this slip cover in the mail and I'm about to put it on this couch. I was gonna throw it in the wash really quick, but um, I figured I should make sure it actually fits first before I wash it so that in case I need to return it. But we are going to move this couch downstairs and move our downstairs couch up here. Our downstairs couch is like an L-shaped, or not L-shaped, it has a chase and it's gray. And I just think like with how tall these walls are and they're all white, that the white couch, I don't know, it's just too, there's not enough contrast. So um, the reason I haven't done that yet though is because downstairs is where our dog sleeps at night. And yeah, so I thought the slip cover would be a perfect solution. We'll just put that on there, put it downstairs, and then we're supposed to be getting um, a different couch in like a while and then we'll sell this one. And yeah, so just to keep it from getting destroyed between then and now. Okay, so here's a slip cover. Definitely not the cutest thing ever, but this is just gonna go down in our basement where literally no one sees it and our dog sleeps on it. So we'll protect it from him. And I think this room will look a lot better once we get our gray couch up here. ceremonial first tile. Don't mess up. Oh, thanks for that. Okay, I think we definitely have a big enough pile of clothes. So we got more in here, here. So now I'm gonna be cutting all the tags off, getting them ready to wash, and then doing his first little laundry, and then I need to stop waving these around, and then we can start getting his drawers put together. I'm gonna go tonight to get more of his drawer organizers and yeah, I'm like way too excited to do a load of laundry and get his drawers organized. But this will definitely be the cutest load of laundry I've ever done and the happiest, so I'm looking forward to it.
Okay, please excuse the absolute wreck of this room, but so his clothes are all, the tags are all off and are in this basket. And I'm going to be washing them and then sorting them into their sizes. I just ordered more of the storage bins on Amazon for his dresser. And those are supposed to be coming tomorrow. So that will be in my next video, kind of going through all his clothes and everything, if anyone even cares. But that's what I'll be doing. So I thought I would like show you guys what his room is looking like right now, even though you'll just have to ignore all the stuff on the floor. But yeah. So on his dresser, we have this Moses basket changing pad, um, and then this basket with just diapers, wipes, and then his creams. Um, and then I kind of showed you inside of his drawers, and I'll be showing you that in the next video. On this wall next to his closet, it's kind of plain, but like the doors right there and everything. I just got this accordion hanger and hung some of his hats, and then I'll use this to store something, not really sure what. I'm thinking of putting some sort of like, like storage cube type things that can also be like a bench under here. I think that would fill up this wall better. His rocking chair is supposed to come on Tuesday, so that's going to be going in this corner. And then I have some shelves that are going to hang above it, and then obviously we're waiting on his curtains still. And I'm probably going to do a shelf over here too. And then we of course just have his crib. I haven't put any crib sheets on it yet or anything, but in this accent wall, still trying to decide what I want to put over his crib. I'm thinking some little like name banner or something, but I'm really not sure. So that's kind of the general overview of his nursery so far. It's coming together really cute. Oh, and above his dresser where it has like the Moses basket and everything, obviously I'm gonna hang something up there. Not sure what yet, but it's coming together. It's looking really cute, exactly like how I wanted it. And I'm really excited to get it together. I think it'll come together a lot this week once like the rocking chair gets here and like bigger things that we've been waiting on. So I will definitely update you guys this week when all of that comes. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. Um, let me know if you enjoy like the nesting cleaning content. I have a lot more planned because Obviously, I'm just kind of entering that mode and I'm ready to get a lot of stuff done. So, I will take you guys along for that if you're interested. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!